My name is uh, Ronald Latticer. I'm the principal and founder of a small branding and marketing firm in Schenectady, New York called Post Marketing. Marketing is one of the really kind of key disciplines, the key skills one needs in order to get a job, start a career, start a business. Being able to teach that uh, to students who are about to really engage that um, I think is a real uh, um, privilege. I do it very much uh, with an eye toward helping my students understand that they actually can be enabled, they can be empowered, they can actually do the thing that they've just been learning about through you know terms and memorization for the last 16 and a half years. One of our public relations efforts on behalf of a San Francisco based consultancy that's actually involved in um, private equity and getting private equity. We managed in one week to get them a featured story in the trade journal, to get them as a featured story on NPR's marketplace, and to get them as the lead story on NBC News. A little hard to answer the question about what the challenges have been because all the challenges have been um, at the same time super exciting and fun. We've gone through a couple of phases. I started the business, I was, you know, self-employed and the sole employee and I was doing it out of the house. So then we moved, uh, you know, pretty quickly into freelance and then I moved into an office and then I started employing people in a more traditional sense. Uh, and then we started getting very large clients. It was a real surprise to me uh, that a small firm, um, you know, based on my previous experience in a large advertising agency, it was actually a surprise to me that a small firm would actually get larger accounts and more critical work than the agency that I worked at previously would get. My interest really is in cultural studies, American studies probably specifically. Um, so my class in advertising tends to be very much kind of a broad class in American studies, history. Uh, the class I teach starts in the 19th century, talking about P.T. Barnum. That might not be a name that's familiar to you, but he was a circus and par uh, he was a, 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 a circus promoter uh, later in his life. From there, I'm able to take my students through history, as well as through marketing, as well as through cultural studies. I always take on these creative challenges thinking that it'll be a nice diversion from the main thing that I do, which is run my business or teach here at UAlbany. And it always kind of like folds right in, it folds right back. And so yeah, I'm on the board of directors of something called the Society for Commercial Archaeology, which is a group of really um, cultural historians, geographers, and preservationists that uh, look at the commercial landscape you know, through the 20th century. Um, and see reflected in it, you know, design, art, culture, um, and talk about that um, as a, you know, kind of an avocation. But that, of course, informs everything else that I do, especially teaching here.